Hello, welcome to the Look Smarter Than You Are with S-Base Configuration Settings series. In this video, we will look at the Spreadsheet Optimized Grid Processing setting. The Spreadsheet Optimized Grid Processing setting would be used in your S-Base Configuration Settings file, or short for S-Base Config file. Of the dozen categories for the config file, the Spreadsheet Optimized Grid Processing setting would fall under the Memory Management category. You might ask, what is this setting used for? Well, it enables optimization for spreadsheet retrievals, where the input grid is parsed into fewer symmetric queries, thus speeding up your spreadsheet retrieval time. Here, we will go over the syntax for the setting. App name is optional. It specifies the application for which optimized grid processing is to be set. If you specify a value for app name and do not specify a value for DB name, the setting applies to all databases in the specified application. To enable the setting for a specific database, you must specify an application and database. If you do not specify an application, you cannot specify a database, and the setting applies to all application and databases on the SBase server. DB name is also optional. It specifies the database in the application specified by app name for which optimized grid processing is to be set. If you specify a value for DB name but do not specify a value for app name, your specification is ignored. Then of course you have the toggle of true and false which enables and disables the optimized grid processing for the spreadsheet operations. And of course the default value is false. Here is an example of how the spreadsheet optimized grid processing setting is used in a configuration file. Since we did not specify the app name or database name, this setting would apply to all application and databases on the SBase server. One last reminder, for any changes to the configuration file to take effect, you must restart the SBase server.